Take Terry is on his 50th take. <laughs> right, so while we're stuck in traffic, I'm gonna give you a little insight into what we're gonna be doing today. I am two and a half weeks out from the Arnold Classic, which is my first show of 2017. It's a show I really can't wait for, and I need to get back on stage and make amends, because last year wasn't a great placing for me, and I'm determined this year is gonna be a big, big year. That being said, obviously there's a lot of training involved in my prep and the nutrition side. So today is gonna be showing you a little insight into my training, and that's why we are on our way down to Fusion Free today. So this is a gym I like to use on a weekly basis, we're gonna be hitting a full body circuit down here. The reason for full body circuits, um, they're great for forcing blood into the muscle group um, and expending calories at the same time. So basically getting the best of both worlds. Um, I like to do this the closer I get to, to uh, show day and obviously we're two and a half weeks out so we're getting very close now. We're gonna do something called cryo freeze. I think it's called cryo freeze. <laughs> and uh, I've never done it before so I'm not gonna um, try and baffle on about the, uh, the the science behind it so we're going to wait for them to explain it all but it's basically to improve uh, the recovery process of doms and muscle soreness later on in the afternoon we're going to head back to my local gym and we're going to hit shoulder session that's going to be heavy weights it's going to be supersets drop sets uh, with my training partner dan trigg <laughs> um, right what else are we talking about that's it i'll do that's it, that's all Ryan's got. <laughs> it's early in the morning, and I'm hungry, and I'm tired, and I'm mardy, but we're getting it done. Trash Day. So obviously if you're training two, three times a day, you're gonna go over that. So 
Um, post workout on this session, I've gone for a white meat, which is turkey mint, fast acting. I've gone for broccoli for my uh, veg, my fibre, and that's a 300 gram white potato. So roughly 50 to 60 grams of carbs post workout. Around what is it? Uh, 50 grams of protein and as much veg as I can get in. Bloody lovely cold. So this is a lymph stim. So it's a cryo, cryo freeze. We're gonna do something called cryo freeze. I think it's called cryo freeze. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I said to him, I'm going, so are we doing the cryo freeze? He looked at me like, what's this guy talking about? So these are 12 chambers that inflate through, through air. Okay. Um, and then it just, like a tube of toothpaste. So from like bottom up, just squeezes it out, gets rid of excess fluids. Um, what, lactic acid, all that, lactic, kind of all that kind of stuff, yeah. <laughs> Can you film with this? <laughs> All the way through the week. Past the week. <laughs> this is a mistake. <laughs> Can the camera? <laughs> how the pressure is, if it gets a bit too much for you, if you don't know, or if you think you can do a little bit more, I'll turn it off. Okay, okay. And then, so like I said, in turn, they've got 12 compartments, right. and they'll start inflating in order. Okay. Um, and they go all the way up to the lower back as well. Nice. Um, so yeah. through, through help with digestion, things like that as well. So, nice. um, so yeah, it's pretty toes all the way up to the lower back. So just having a little bit of an issue with his infraspinatus, which is lateral rotation, external rotation. They're actually just going through his chest at the minute. Massive believer in like myofascial release. So releasing the fascia around the, the muscles is gonna help the muscle grow. Start to come through here a lot more though. You all right? You're starting to come for a bit more. Yeah. We had a big chest session yesterday. It was a bit brutal, actually. Yeah. I tried training it again in that circuit, and it was hurting. Yeah. Keep coming through the chest. Yeah. You can't actually kind of stretch your bicep, because obviously it doesn't go any further than that. So you have to do kind of a positional release, or some people call it active release, and just pin the muscle. Stretch it a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Get that on your film. <laughs> this is the point at which he shits himself. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Shit. Whoa. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Whoa. Oh. Feels good. Feels good. Even, even, even the video guys, I just, I just get out of his program. <laughs> even Johnny's got to get out of here. <laughs> that looks about 50 shades from here. It does, it does. I think it actually is. <laughs> so now we're just going to do some deep tissue massage on his, on his back. Open up these wings um, so he looks nice and wide. Um, go through any muscle tension, soreness, things, things like that. Um, and then we're going to get the X-Wave on um, specific muscles. His infraspinatus on this side always gives him a little bit of problem, so we're going to really get into that. Oh, my last In there still? Sort of there, yeah. Pressure 
sending the waves through into the muscle. <laughs> oh yes, so we just got off the bed, um, done a full body massage, um, we hit some different treatments as well, obviously saw the, I keep forgetting what it's called, I want to call it a cryo freeze, but it, I think it sounds better as a cryo freeze, but what's it called, a lymphatic drainage, yeah, so lymphostim, lymphostim, and then so, an and an X-Wave, so I wasn't a massive fan of the X-Wave, I understand uh, the science behind it, uh, it was just a bit uncomfortable, it just felt like someone was hitting with your hammer repetitively uh, on your shoulder, um, but it did get into my infraspinatus and uh, release it, so um, yeah, it was good, really good, uh, now I want to sleep. So we're down here at Good Bodies Gym, which is my local gym, and we're hitting the second session of today. Um, as you saw earlier, obviously we hit full body circuit. Tonight's session is about shoulders. So we're gonna be doing a bit of heavy weights, low reps, and then we're gonna be super setting, uh, high volume, keeping the intensity there. Like I said, I'm two and a half weeks out from the Arnold. Uh, this is more about expending calories and staying full and trying to just bring those finer details in within my physique. Four to five, let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, uh, two, come on. Push, last one. Yeah, good one. Spending calories. So, the next uh, two exercises we're going to do a superset now. We're going to do a Smith machine press, superset with a front raise. Ah, good. Come on, Come on. Eight, nine, ten. Up, good. And again. Up, nice. And again. Up, good lad. Yep. Oh, 
Right, next we're doing four sets of lateral raise and we're going to start ever. Each is going to be a drop set to a light set. See how fast you get there now. Right, we're going to do this next. Fucking <laughs> free workouts. <laughs> right, we're doing lateral raise. Right, so what he says in English, we're going to do a dumbbell raise, heavy, 8 to 10 reps, and then we're going to drop down to a lighter set just to squeeze and isolate the side delt. Drop.
tip you could do two weeks out from the Arnold Classic. So earlier on in the morning, obviously I did the full body weighted circuit. Later this afternoon, I have done um, a single muscle part, heavy weight, high repetition, high volume, high intensity, um, and that's a great way for me um, to burn fat but maintain muscle as much as possible. I will be consuming obviously the right amount of nutrition in order to feed those two workouts. So if you want to try it and get involved at home, make sure your nutrition is on point as well. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. Subscribe below and comment on anything you want on future videos. Cheers guys.